Good morning, everybody, or afternoon. I don't know, whatever, it's it's like 1.30. I had a pretty late night, so I didn't roll out of bed till like 12.30. But nonetheless, here we are. And today is gonna be kind of like a day in the life type deal with D-Tang, the day in the life of a professional bowler. But before we get started, please smash the like button because apparently it helps the algorithm. We had a video with Mikey bowling doubles and uh, that got a lot of views because we're guessing number of likes. So, uh, yeah, we appreciate it. But now uh, we're gonna go practice today, go check out a house for my aunt, and then we're gonna stream and maybe work out later. We probably should work out after stream. We will work out after stream, but look at this mess. I gotta clean up a little bit here, but I also have to decide what I'm gonna bring to practice. All right, so we're gonna head down to Simo's place, The Nerd, downtown Fremont Street. If you're ever in town, check it out. It's pretty cool. And contrary to what most of you may believe about Simo, just from watching him on TV, he's one of the coolest dudes I know. So, just because you see what we're like on TV doesn't mean that's what we're like in real life. All right, guys, don't hate on my life choices. I'm getting in and out for lunch before I go to practice. Like I said, I woke up kind of late, so I didn't have breakfast, and I need something quick, so. It's cheap, I think it's good, and yes, it's overrated. But overrated doesn't mean bad. All right, I'm gonna address the mask thing while I'm waiting in line because this line's going long. But without getting political about it, I see a lot of comments in the comment section about me wearing a mask when I bowl tournaments, especially when um, there are no mask restrictions. I am not fully vaccinated yet. And if I do end up catching COVID, that means that there will be less content for you guys. I get COVID, get sick, I can't bowl. If I can't bowl, there's no bowling content. So I think wearing a mask is a pretty small price to pay for being able to go out and do what I do for a living. So I hope you understand and I hope that makes sense to you all. And if it doesn't, then it is what it is. And uh, I'm not sorry, I'm not gonna be sorry about it. And like I said, I don't wanna get too political about it. So I don't wanna get political at all. So I'm not going to. So that's the reason why I wear a mask. Thank you. up a pretty short practice session uh, okay things I worked on timing timing I had one two and three steps really focusing on waiting for the ball to get to the top of the swing and initializing my slide step before the ball starts to drop so ball gets to the peak start the slide let it drop um, so the reason why I do one two and three steps is to try to integrate it into my full approach because if I go straight from the one step to the full approach it just doesn't translate that well to me, so being able to feel it using different steps really helps me figure out, or helps my body figure out what I need to do. Um, second, really trying to stabilize my left arm. I think it's going a little too hard, and that's why I pull it sometimes. And um, my right shoulder kind of gets disconnected a little too much, it drops too much. I'm trying to keep everything a little more compact to help with repeatability. And then the last thing I was working on was uh, lowering my backswing a little bit so I can get under it easier and stay under it longer. Cause I kinda, I tend to hit it too early and I think it's all because I'm 
early with my timing. Um, so I'm trying to stay under it longer so I can generate more power. And so I'm not using my thumb as much to try to try to hit it. If I can stay under it a little longer, it becomes more like that two-handed effect where the fingers are where they need to be and all I have to do is let the ball roll, or let my hand roll through it. So that's how I practiced today. Uh, cool, got to see Simo. Um, you guys saw him at the end of that last B-roll clip. And uh, I usually practice with Marshall when we come down to the nerd, so solid so far. We're gonna head down to uh, check out a, a house for my aunt because she's planning on moving down here, which is cool because she makes cookies. So once she moves down here, I love cookies all the time. Let's go. All right, we made it to the house that we're checking out for Auntie Sandy. Hi, David. Hi, Sandy. How are you? Good, how are you? Good. Some could say she's the rich auntie. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I'm here with David Haynes, which you might yes. not know about Dave, is he's also into real estate. That is true. So if you're looking to buy a home in Vegas, find Dave. Yes, and I'm easy to find. gonna wrap up our mini house tour um, yeah my aunt's moving out here she's been looking this is the third house that I've looked at for her and uh, they're just flying off the market they're so hard to get a little far for me but it's okay I'm, it's not really about me I'm gonna head back home gonna fire up the stream and then hopefully still get this workout in tonight see you on stream all right here we are I'm gonna give you guys a little look at the setup if I haven't shown you on YouTube before, but our big old Godox light, dual monitor setup, G Pro Wireless, G915 TKL, Blue Yeti mic, Astro A40 headphones, and then a ridiculous amount of Pokemon cards. And the house! The boys. My PC. I just finished up stream. Feel free to click the link down below, twitch.tv slash vitamin D tang if you feel like following and joining us for our streams every day when we're home, usually Monday through Wednesday um, when I have time. A lot of editing since we're uploading one vlog a day this month. So a lot of the streams are just me editing. Sometimes I'll play games after, but if you want to come hang out, just kick it. Feel free. All right, I'm gonna get this leg workout in. done with the workout time to get cooking well, first I think I'm gonna make a protein shake cheers defrost our little shrimpies we're gonna get some garlic probably two cloves have some leftover rice that I'm just gonna heat up and then we have butter the broth is open I like broth.
There we got it. There we have it. There we go. Yeah. Garlic soy, shrimp, frozen broccoli over rice. Simple, easy. Yeah, dinner time, 9.30. But uh, this is pretty much a typical day for me. I'll practice, I'll work out, make food. I don't get up early enough for breakfast. Terrible habit, especially because I'm trying to gain weight. Uh, so I, I really gotta make sure I get the calories in for the day. But nonetheless, normal day. Tomorrow I get my COVID shot, second dose. Um, again, after I get this second dose, I'll feel a little more comfortable about not wearing my mask in uh, places where it's allowed. But of course, if it is required to wear a mask, I will wear my mask. It doesn't matter to me. You can believe or not believe in COVID. I just want to be able to put out content. I want to be able to compete. And I don't want something to stop me from doing that. And if I catch COVID, that will stop me. That's going to do it for today's vlog. Thanks for watching. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. It really helps out the channel. And we'll catch you tomorrow. Peace.